Hey Scorpio Collective, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. Um, we're going to do a love reading for you guys, what's coming in for you for the month of February. This is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please like the video if you enjoy the reading and if it resonates and subscribe if you want. Um, we're going to go ahead and get started. Spirit, if you would, show me for the sign of Scorpio. Guys, I'm going to use a main tarot deck, the clarifying deck here. I'm going to get some live tarot oracles and some sacred soul portal oracles to see if I can get you guys a clear message. What happening? What is happening for the Scorpio Collective for the month of February? This is a different type of spread, guys, so just bear with me and see it through. It's going to give you a lot of clarity, okay? Um, so let's see. What do we have for you guys? Show me the energy that the person that the Scorpio Collective is um, watching this reading for. Show me the energy that that person is currently in. Show me the energy of Scorpio's person. The world card. So the world card could be a um, beginning or an ending. The world card is Capricorn energy um, or it can be fixed sign energy. So you may be dealing with the Capricorn or you may be dealing with the fixed sign. Um, but it looks like there is either a ending or a beginning for this person um show me their thoughts show me the, their thoughts for scorpio show me their thoughts the seven of swords uh the seven of swords is either this person was a manipulator or they felt like you have lied and deceived them we're going to find out more as we get into it show me the feelings that this person has for scorpio show me this person's feelings here it is the tower they felt like something happened out of nowhere that it was an instant and like a um something that was unexpected just happened out of nowhere it was like it just like a lightning strike boom and everything was gone so this person feels like they didn't get any heads up that's aquarius and aries energy they feel like they didn't get any heads up to um, know what was happening with the situation when it ended and they felt like they were stabbed in the back with the seven of swords um show me the obstacle what's the obstacle in this connection show me the obstacle in this connection for scorpio and their person um the ten of cups so there's a ten of cups here either there is a already made connection um with this person that you're dealing with meaning they are already married or in a higher level of commitment or you are so the obstacle is the ten of cups either someone already has it or you guys trying to obtain it together as we clarify we will find out what's the desire show me the desire for this person with regard to scorpio for the month of february the ten of pentacles so the ten of pentacles is here this person is saying they want this long-term con connection with you um if you did not deceive this person they may have deceived you and had another person already in a higher level commitment with them and also trying to make a commitment happen with you as well um show me friends and family how does uh this person's friends and family see scorpio and this person in their connection how does scorpio's not scorpio how does this person's friend and family see scorpio and the person in this connection let's see queen of pentacles so they feel like it's a stable connection they feel like it is one that is based on something that can go the distance the queen of pentacles is solid and stable and the queen of pentacles is a wife and a mother so they feel like there's a lot of stability here with you and this person show me the potential outcome show me the potential outcome and then we're going to get to clarifying it fell queen of cups so the queen of cups is here cancer scorpio pisces energy queen of pentacles taurus virgo capricorn energy this saying that there is a lot of love that this relationship is founded on and the outcome is love um and this is um love that is matured this is not immature um infatuation this is real stone cold love so at the bottom of the deck your energy is going to be the four of wands so you want this long-term connection with this person you want the home the family and the um solid relationship built on nothing but stability and love you're asking and wanting this to happen with this person so i'm gonna try to figure out what happened because it looks good but something around here in this area acted up for you guys and we're gonna see if we can find out what it was show me this world card why is this the world card for scorpio's person why is this world card here for scorpio's person why is this world card here show me the world card show me the world card 
the Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so there may have been an ending with this person to move towards a Queen of Pentacles. Um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy, whether it is a male or a female, it doesn't matter. This person moved towards a feminine energy that may have been a Queen of of pinnacles um show me this um seven of swords show me the seven of swords so this person may have okay and at the what came out was the knight of swords so someone wants to come in and talk about this this is either you or that person because they feel like they were mistreated or that they were stabbed in the back by this connection um this the knight of swords says that someone is going to make a fast action to come in and communicate whether that's you or this person because someone felt like they were truly wrong in the situation and they didn't see this tower moment happening show me this tower some of you guys may have found out that this person was married because that is and then what popped out now is the emperor this is um like I said, a married energy with the Queen of Pentacles. The Emperor is coming out. Aries energy on top of this tower. So you very well may be dealing with someone that you found out was married or in a higher level of commitment. And this person didn't tell you. Or either you were in a higher level of commitment and didn't tell this person. Clarify this uh, Ten of Pentacles for me. Clarify this Ten of Cups for me, please. Clarify this Ten of Cups. I know I said Pentacles, but I want to clarify the Ten of Cups. Clarify this Ten of Cups for me. The Moon. Yep, it was hitting. It was hitting. This is Pisces energy. This Ten of Cups or this relationship with this outside party was hitting. Someone hid a marriage or a higher level of commitment from someone else in this connection that's pisces energy you may be dealing with the pisces you may not be show me this ten of pentacles show me this ten of pentacles that's why i love this spread because baby it's gonna break all of it down show me this ten of pentacles show me this ten of pentacles the ten of swords yeah their ability to try to obtain this ten of pentacles with you was shut down by this ten of swords um so it looks like they i don't know who it is at this point if it's you or them it could be either way because energies are fluid so someone got caught they didn't confess it because the moon is here saying that it was hidden no one spoke this because i don't see any type of um words saying that or any type of cards that says that this was vocalized to anybody what i'm seeing is someone found out that this person either you or the other person was already involved in a higher level of commitment or marriage and it was something that was not known and this person not only feels like it was or whoever it was not only feels like they were completely betrayed out of nowhere they felt like it was an instant attack that happened that brought this entire relationship down and they felt like they were stabbed in the back with regard to it they felt like they were completely demolished by the other person. Um, show me this Queen of Pentacles in the friends and family. You know what? With this being in the friends and family is that Queen of Pentacles. This may be something that the family already knew about because that Queen of Pentacles is in the friends and family. Show me the Queen of Pentacles. Clarify that Queen of Pentacles for me. Five of Pentacles. Yep. Family already knew about it. The entire family already knew about it. And at the bottom of the deck, I have the wand's energy. This is the phallic symbol of the tarot. Someone allowed this ace of wands to come in and create conflict here. Um, I'm going to leave that card here. Um, I need to clarify this queen of cups in the middle. Clarify the queen of cups. Clarify this queen of cups for me. Give me three cards on this outcome. Give me three cards on this outcome. Two of Pentacles, five of Wands, and the Six of Swords. Yeah, so here's the deal. And at the bottom of the deck, again, I have the Four of Wands. So here's what's happening with this. Someone's juggling with the Two of Pentacles, and it looks like they're going to continue to juggle. There's going to be, or there is, conflict already happening. Lots of people already involved. Lots of chaos, lots of confusion. But you're going to move forward with the Six of Swords without this person. Um, and the Four of Wands is here because you're seeking this um, with someone else. It doesn't look like it's going to be with this person because this person is possibly going to go back um, to the person that they are dealing with. There's a Four of Wands here and a Four of Wands here. So there's two committed relationships already in this connection 
and because of what is happening here and the juggling still is going to continue even in the outcome it looks like you're just going to move away and bail out gracefully and say hey I, I i just have to let it go i can't be a part of this chaos and confusion i don't want any parts of it i'm letting it go spirit give me some oracles for the sign of scorpio this is a man show me the okay spirit is saying this is a soulmate that you're with and this person knows it they felt that uh, connection and they are choosing to move in a different direction though um, alone also popped out so someone feels abandoned and alone in this connection show me more and destructive uh, destruction someone definitely destructed or uh, caused a destruction here spirit is saying it's time for you to ascend because this person has not ascended um, and because you are more mature in your faith spirituality and things like that you have ascended and this person is not and this connection is not going to be able to come together as your soulmate should until they ascend and be the person that they're supposed to be and that is to end this other connection and try to work the situation out with you but as you guys know we're not always destined to be with our soulmates for a lifetime soulmates are sometimes sent in to teach us a lesson and this person may have pushed you into a spiritual awakening putting you alone um, to contemplate over this destruction so that you could ascend um, in your spirituality so that you can find this um, four of wands um, the one that is truly meant for you um, show me more um, strong power you tapped into reserves you didn't know you had of course and they helped you get to the next level spirit is saying yeah you used a lot of your internal power to muster through this situation and um, you're going to reap the benefits of a four ones on the outside of this connection also mysteries appreciate what you don't know and seek to learn more before you make a decision yes yeah, spirit is saying just sit with yourself they are going to guide you on your next moves and actions just stay still and um continue to reach out to the divine also sudden uh strike you get some shocking news but not to worry the universe is taking care of you always that's correct this person is probably going to tell you with this knight of swords that they're going back to this other person and spirit is saying that's fine and dandy because i have it for ones over here already waiting for you also at the bottom of the deck reflecting it's time to remember the past and bring that wisdom forward to assist you now spirit is saying you're learning some valuable lessons use those lessons to move forward so that you can have what you desire this is what i have for you scorpio i hope it brings you peace clarity and direction hit that like button and take care guys i'll see you on the next one